This episode of Lost Anarchy Presents has been brought to you by Cigarette.com. Greetings, everyone, and welcome to Tales from the Black Side. I'm your host, Gypsy Black. Tales from the Black Side. Um, usually these are written articles, but this time I'm now animated. Finally! Even though most people think I'm a cartoon anyway. So, it's a natural transition. A little bit about me, uh, since most some of you might not know who I am. Uh, I do vocals for a band called Black. It's gonna be rant, raving, just some babblings. And maybe you can learn a thing or two from some of this shit. Who knows? Just pay attention. And now, on with the show. Kind of a new show. Well done. I'm gonna start a new segment for each episode. Nigga, please. That I like to call people who should shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. First up, anyone who's ever uttered a phrase similar to. This is America, you need to speak English. Nobody wants to hear that gibberish. If you said anything in any combination, we were remotely close to this, you need to- SHUT THE FUCK UP! Here's why. Why ask why? Yes, this is America. Basically, a place that's pretty much founded by immigrants, you know, original immigrants who came over and just kind of just took shit over, but hey. I claim this land in the name of Zion. What's the immigrants nonetheless? They took our jobs! If anybody has the writ, right to bitch about You're not welcome here. Any language? Speak English! I think the natives kind of have you beat on that. People can stop it. I mean, seriously, I mean... What the fuck is this? You're gonna talk shit about people not speaking English. Really? When you can barely speak English yourself and you were fucking born here and you're some... I'm gonna run for fucking... President. Redneck hick. Everyone rise for the greatest commercial ever. And even when you say America, you say America. America? You know, really, you're gonna really talk shit about somebody whose English just isn't that good? Sorry. Your argument is invalid. Please. Shut the fuck up! If you're a white person... Go back to your country, white power! Well, I'm gonna piss somebody off with this. But, as I was saying, if you're a white person, and whenever Black History Month comes up, or Latino Heritage Month, or whatever pops up, and you've ever uttered the phrase, Well, why can't we have a White History Month? You seriously need to shut the fuck up. The reason why that there is no White History Month is because Every month is White History Month. And we always talk about the good, but what about the bad and the ugly? Even on the months that are designated as Black History Month or Latino History, you still have white history going on and you still have holidays. Like you have President's Day, stuff like that, on the month that's designated as Black History Month. So you know what? That's bullshit. And it, like I said, anyone who says this is a complete fucking idiot. Seriously. Hello. I just want to put this out there right now. This is George Zimmerman. People who still defend George Zimmerman. Oh my fucking God. Shut the fuck up. Yes, it's been almost a year, okay? It's been a while. It's, it's no matter, this guy keeps proving himself to be stupid all the time. He's like in the news. And Hello, Mr. Zimmerman. Your country needs you. What do you need from me? He gets away with some of the stupidest shit, but yet he's there. I mean... We... Need you to shoot a young African-American for us. This guy is a murderer. I gave that up. A fucking... Someone who... He was someone who condones domestic violence. The list goes on. You know, even, this guy was even part of some cop trying to help him fake a fucking... Saving someone's life in a car accident. And then later expose his bullshit. And yet, you motherfuckers are still defending him. Really? Come on, guys. Really? This guy... What the fuck? Okay, it, okay. And then a lot of you... You know, you, you want to start this shit like, well, it's not really a racist thing, because he's like half Mexican or something. You got a guy who is kind of half white, kind of half Mexican, with a great grandma who's black. So it's okay. And then you got a black kid. No, what, you see, no, okay, number one, if that's... You can't shoot someone who threatens you just out on the street. Well, unless, of course, you're in a state that has a stand-your-ground law. It's a stupid law. That they got. That, that's a stupid thing that happened over there. Come on. Fucking it's racist idiots. Yeah, but you know, it's okay, man. You know why? 
because, you know, all those Mexicans and blacks are thugs anyway, so maybe they just kill themselves off, so. Both were set on fire. Who would you piss on to put out first? You know, that's why I think George Zimmerman is innocent. Neither either. You know, while we're at it, we'd get out marshmallows and have a, a, a marshmallow roast. We should keep them gays and Libyans shopping in our stores and spending money and helping out the economy. Damn queers and blacks and Mexicans always fucking shit up for us. All right, thanks for everybody for checking out the first episode here, Black TV. Any questions, comments, anything like that, you can go to the Ian Black Facebook page or go through Lost Anarchy Magazine's Facebook page. Send an email to gypsyblack at gmail.com or just leave a comment here on YouTube, which make sure you subscribe, by the way. Because there's lots of good shit here on Los Anarchy Magazine. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe or I will scratch your eyeballs out. This episode has been brought to you by Ziggret.com. There's nothing fake about it. We're the source for electronic cigarettes. Welcome to the 21st century. Quit smoking and start vaping. No tar, no secondhand smoke, no pollution, no offensive odors. Smoke without the guilt. We carry everything from egos to traditional electric cigarettes and a full line of accessories. So please come on down to Ziggret.com. All of our flavors are produced right here in the United States. And we can even say our flavors are kosher. So for the best flavors, the best vaping experience, that you can get, go to ziggred.com. And remember, all the flavor you will get vaping on your cigarette at ziggred.com. That's Z I G R E T.com.